Two students are dead and two others were wounded in a shooting outside of Chicago High School yesterday. These are new photos of the shooter at Juarez High School. These were released this morning by Chicago Police. Casey Cronus reports. Good morning. Sources tell us all four of those victims are Benito Juarez students shot on their own campus as they were getting ready to start the weekend. 1012 in the city was near call of a person shot. 2150 South Laughlin, 2150 South Laughlin at Harris Benito community. Just as students were being dismissed, gunfire erupted outside Benito Juarez High School in Pilsen. It's shocking. Around 2.40 p.m., parents like Emmanuel Orozco got frantic phone calls from their children as first responders rushed to the school. The security guards in the school were telling them, go to the nearest classroom. Police say four teens were shot. Hearing all these shootings in the schools is, is scary. <laughs> scary to find out that your daughter is in one of the schools that just got shot. The victims were taken to Stroger Hospital, where family members gathered throughout the evening. A 14-year-old and 15-year-old boy were both shot in the head and died. Another 15-year-old boy was shot in the shoulder and is in good condition. And a 15-year-old girl who suffered a graze wound is also expected to be okay. We have pod camera throughout the neighborhood, so we're reviewing all of that camera, as well as our teams, our area technology teams, they respond to shootings. Superintendent Brown says there is no one in custody yet. So all of us are trying to find answers. Um, of course, I'm very concerned because this happened on our grounds. Chicago Public Schools CEO Pedro Martinez, who is also a graduate of Juarez, says they will be providing counseling support to students. CPS officials say they will be enhancing security in and around the school beginning on Monday. Next Thursday marks the last day of class before winter break. Reporting Casey Cronus, Fox 32, Chicago.